Hi guys, I wanna answer the question, is fructose, which is a low glycemic sweetener, safe to consume? Okay, I mean, I mean after all, it's in fruit, right? So it should be healthy. Uh, agave nectar has a low glycemic index and has 97% fructose. Uh, but here's the problem. High fructose corn syrup, uh, which is all GMO, uh, is in the soft drinks, it's in the big gulp, it's in the fruit juices, the jams, the candy, the syrups, the dressings, it's in, 80% of all the foods in the, in the U.S. have high fructose corn syrup. I mean, that's just off the charts. Well, here's the thing. Your cells do not use fructose as the energy source. That's not what the cells use. The cells use glucose or ketones. Um, and the effect of fructose is very similar to ethanol or alcohol. Okay? So your body treats it like alcohol, so it's very toxic. Um, and it's the absolute worst type of carbohydrate you could possibly consume. And I'm not talking about fruit, I'm talking about high fructose corn syrup. Um, and this is why, because 100% of the fructose is metabolized by your liver. And the amount of fructose that people consume on a regular basis just puts that liver into an overwhelmed state very fast. And you're gonna develop a fatty liver, you're gonna spike your cholesterol, your triglycerides, and you're gonna make a tremendous amount of visceral fat that's around your gut, that's around the organs, which is gonna to lead to all sorts of issues. So the three main things, the side effects of high fructose corn syrup is a fatty liver, insulin resistance, and belly fat. Other than that, it's totally fine, right? I'm being very sarcastic. And I have a question for you. Um, would you let your kids drink beer or alcohol? If the answer is no, then you definitely don't want them to do the high fructose corn syrup because it has a very similar effect that alcohol has on the liver and the rest of the body. All right? There's a lot of alternative things that you can give your kids. I'll put some links down below as far as sweeteners, uh, even drinks, uh, stevia drinks, uh, soda, soda with stevia. I mean, you can do all that. So I'll put some links down below. All right, talk to you later. So Karen and I are gonna create some more recipes, but we wanted to know what recipes are you interested in, okay? Click the link and let us know.